Hi, Cadence. Hi. We are going to be reading a book today. And this is one of our pre-books. It's going to show us how to read these blue books. And this book's title is A Hat. That's the name of the book. Now, anytime before we start reading a book, we always look at the pictures first, right? Mm. So let's do that. Let's look at this picture on the cover mm. of the book. What do you see? A hat. A hat, yeah. Do you want to tell me more about it? Uh, it's red and it has a yellow feather. Yeah. And what do you see in this picture? A girl wearing a hat. Very good. How about here? Uh, well, she has the hat on her head when, because the other sh page shows that she's putting it, so mm -hmm. she has it. Now she has it on and there. she's tapping it. Yeah, and what do you see here? A boy that's sat, that's sitting. And how about here? He's sad. Good job. So we just did a picture walk, right? Mm -hmm. And now we're going to practice the words in the boxes. So if you look over here... These are the words we have to know in order to read this book, okay? So let's sound these words out, okay? Mm -hmm. What does S say? Let's do the movement for it. Do it with two hands for sunset. Good, that's sunset. And then what does A say? Good, what does D say? D. D, D, D. So let's sound it out, ready? Get your bubble gum and let's bu bubble gum the sounds. Go like this. And you're gonna stretch the sounds out while we say it. Sad. Again. Sad. What word do you hear? Sad. Sad, yeah. Sad. <laughs> now let's listen to the sounds in this word. Ready? What does S say? Show me the movement. What does A say? What does T say? T. Good. Now you know the sounds. We're going to put those sounds together to hear the word. Ready? Sat. Again? Sat. What word do you hear? Sat. 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 Now this next word is a tricky S word. And we say tricky S because it's a little trickier to sound out four letters instead of three, right? So I'm going to cover up the tricky S, and we're just going to sound out these three sounds, okay? What does T say? T. Good. What does A say? Ah. Good. And what does P say? Uh. Oh, that's a piece of pie, so we do like we're eating a pie. P. Huh. P. Good. So let's sound these out. Ready? Get your bubble gum, and we're going to stretch the sounds together. T. A. P. Again. Tap. What do you hear? Tap. Tap. Now let's add that tricky S. Taps. Again. Taps. And we know this sight word from our sight word keys, right? What does that say? A. A. <laughs> what does it say when a. it's all by itself? A. It says its name, right? Because mm -hmm. it's a runaway vowel and it runs away because nothing's blocking it. So now we're going to read the book. Okay. And for every... Um, if we're teaching somebody how to read, what we would do is we would have them make the movement for every letter and then we would sound it out, right? Mm -hmm. So let's do that for a little bit. All right, what does A say when it's by itself? A. Yeah, so we don't need to do anything with this one. Mm -hmm. It's an easy word to read. What does H say? Ha. Huh. Ha, make your happy house. Ha. With two hands? Two hands? Ha, ha, ha. What does A say? Ah. What does T say? T. T, T, T. Let's sound it out together. Hat. Uh, Get your bubble gum. Hat. What's the word? Hat. Hat. Very good. What do you see here? What does A say when it's by itself? A. A. And let's uh, see this one. What does H say when? What does H say? H. Good. H. Ah, and then t. Good. So let's bubblegum these sounds together. Ready? H uh, at. H uh, at. What word is that? Hat. Hat. 
Good habit. A hat. So the title of the book is the same as the first page. <laughs> Easy. Yeah. So let's see. What does P say here? P. What does A say? Ah. Good. What does M say? Mm. Mm, let's bubble gum it. P am. Again. P am. What word is that? Pam. Pam. We're going to cover up the tricky S on this word, okay? And do the movements for this one. Ready? What does T say? T. Good. What does A say? What does P say? P. 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 Good. Let's sound it out. T. App. T. App. What word do you hear? Tap. Tap. Now we're going to add that tricky S. What would it become? Tap. Good. And then let's hear. What does S say? Do your movements. Sunset. Good. What does A say? Ah. What does M say? Mm. Mm hmm. Good. You remember that one. You haven't done this in a long time because you've been reading for a while, huh? Mm -hmm. Let's sound this out. Sam. Again? Sam. What word is that? Sam. Sam. Let's try this one. What does S say? Show me the movements. What does A say? Ah. What does T say? T. Good. Let's sound it out. Sat. Again. Sat. What word do you hear? Sat. Sat. Good. Sat. So here it says Pam taps. Sam sat. So maybe the girl's name is Pam, right? And the boy's name is Sam. So it's telling us the characters in the story. What does S say? Show me the movement. Sunset. Good. What does A say? What does D say? D. Good. Let's sound that out. Sad. Again? Sad. What word is that? Sad. Sad. Yeah. He doesn't look very happy, does he? So that's definitely matching the picture. And what does S say? Show me your sunset. Yeah. What does A say? And what does M say? Mm. Mm, let's bubble gum it. Sam. Again? Sam. What word Sam. is that? Sam. So it's saying sad Sam. Why do you think he's sad? Because maybe that was his hat. Then she picked it, picked it up. He was about to get it. Could and then be. he was sad. Yeah, it could be that, definitely. Or it could be that it that she had a hat and he did not. And he didn't like that very much, too. And he wanted a hat. And he wanted a hat, too, exactly. Thank you. Thank you for helping me sand these out. I love you. Mm -hmm. <laughs>